everybody this is Tina with Loving Life's Little Blessings and I am going to make a card for you guys today. We are using a Creative Challenge Club sketch. I'm going to insert that sketch right here for you. For you. Now that you've seen basically what we're going to be making, let's jump in. I am the sketch looks like a square card and I'm I'm not good at making other size cards. I really like to just stick to a standard A2 size card which is four and a half um four and a quarter by five and a half. And so that's what I did. I just took a piece of Cajun Craze cardstock and I cut that in half and then I folded it and did this orientation of a card, which is my favorite. Um, I have a layer that we're going to put on here. This is a four by five and a quarter. And I just used the wood grain embossing folder and um, Okay, I'm just gonna keep going. Okay, so then I have my next layer. Now this is a three and a half by three and a half inch square, and I've embossed this with a really old embossing folder. It's this floral embossing folder. And it is going to go down here, and it can just go on top. And I have some sticky strip on the back of this because it doesn't tend to take adhesive very well like the ATG gun doesn't really work on it. So I really didn't know how else to get this to stick and I really hate sticky strip. I think it is the worst pain in the neck ever. It's hard to get off and then these things stick to you. But it's the only thing that I could think that would make it, it stick. So I just used sticky strip stuck that down so I have a framelit piece and I had just used I used my big shot and I cut that out and then this is the stamp set that I got and I had really wanted to play with it I showed a picture of this on Instagram uh, when I was actually working on making the card um, if you are interested, you'll want to make sure you follow me on Instagram. I'm always sharing what I'm doing, photos of things, sneak peeks. So I'm going to take some Cajun Craze and I'm going to take the Thanks, which I already have here on a block. And we're just going to stamp that. This is going to get layered right here. And then I have one of these leaves. This is from the fall, um, fun fall framelit set. And it had um, a ghost and pumpkins and then these leaves. And we're gonna put that right there. And then I'm just going to take a jewel and put that right there and that is going to be my card today but I wanted to show you guys how I stepped up this one so on this one I stamped the whole image in Cajun Craze and then I stamped the image again in Crushed Curry which is this color um, and then I just cut this little flag banner out and then I put that up on dimensionals and it really made this card pop I thought it was really cute I don't know that I would do that if I was mass producing the card because you know it was a little bit of work that banner is really thin but I really 
I really um, liked the way it turned out. So I would love to hear what you guys think. Uh, sorry, so first, so sorry this video has been such a mess, you guys. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's like I've never shot a video. I don't know what's going on. So sorry it was a mess. And then I would love to hear which one you guys like better. Do you guys like the one that has this banner that's popped up in a different color better? Or do you just like it all one color? I would love